This is Daisy, the solar powered tricycle that's come out to, from Vancouver. Be with you, Heat. That's sustainable. So glad we could be here. So this year, sustainable is, is way bigger. Um, our team had to grow a lot to do everything that we're doing this year. So of course we have all the rides running on waste vegetable oil. We have solar powered stage again, but it's way bigger. And now we have the new energy pavilion, which is kind of like a museum of energy. And we've built a secret game in there and you can win prizes doing it. And then we have the Green Beast competition, much like the Canadian race. And we've got $15,000 in prizes to give away on Sunday for the Green Beast. So it was a massive effort to pull together. We're way bigger this year, but way more fun. Sustainable returns to McDonald Island showcasing alternative fuel while having a good time in doing so. The yearly carnival attracted many people on many rides, including a special ride from Vancouver. So Daisy, the solar powered tricycle, is here. As far as we know, it's the largest solar powered tricycle in the world. She stands at about 20 feet tall, and you're right, it comes, it's, it's kind of like a cartoon rolling around or a, a Salvador Dali painting, but it's beautiful and it's solar powered, and it's here in McMurray for the first time. Besides Daisy, Sustainable is a perfect way to end the summer, bringing families together, viewing the sights, and enjoying the rides. Labor Day weekend is quickly becoming a weekend for Sustainable in Fort McMurray. It, this is our time, you know. The community keeps telling us to come back on Labor Day. We're obliged. We love this place, and so we'll come back for as long as you guys want us to come back. For Go and Bringing the Excitement, I'm Doug Roxburgh. Really?